Hey YouTube, this is Andrea coming to you with my Rite Aid haul. And just real brief, I'm not going to take up too much of you guys' time. Um, I just want to speak on the Glade glitch that was going on at um, Dollar General. Now, I'm not bashing anybody because I did it. You know, I used that coupon um, that they had for the Glade deal. And I even put up a video about it. Now, <clears throat> my problem with this is... Like I said, I'm not bashing anybody, but um, I was kind of upset because I seen a couple of uh, couponers on there stating that, you know, we misuse the coupon and blah, 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 and so on and so on. And it still is a glitch. Okay. So my problem with that is that if you go back on some of those, like I'm, I'm still like a new couponer, maybe a year and a half or two in. Okay. So I've learned to coupon from certain people. So I've, if you go back on some of these long-term couponers, which is the people who have the problem with, you know, us misusing, quote-unquote, the coupon, if you go back on some of their uh, videos, you know, to me, the same thing is like at Walgreens a couple months back. They had a glitch where they were give, giving out all these points if you... um you uh spent something i think it was on razors or whatever but it was giving you too many points that is a glitch and if you know that it's wrong you're still doing the deal anyway knowing that they're giving you more points than you're supposed to be that is misuse as far as i'm concerned you know so then on top of that like you know they're talking about you know the coupon use co using coupons the right way and blah 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 so and to me if you have a digital and it says, you know, because if you're going to be doing the right thing and, you, you know, you're talking about everybody else misusing these coupons, that if you're going to be straightforward and doing the right thing, then if you have a digital and it's for, say, $4 off a product and you have another digital for $3 off a product. Now, if it snatches off that $4 digital, you so, you know, you're so honest now. You need to go to that cashier and tell them, oh, you need to um, add a dollar. If they snatch off that other one, you need to add, you know, tell the uh, cashier, can you add a dollar onto my purchase because it snatched off the wrong coupon? Because if you're going to be honest about it, it's still misusing coupons. That's all I'm trying to say. You know, I'm not bashing anybody or anything like that. Like I said, you know, to each their own. I did the glitch. It worked out perfect for me. Some people have a problem with that. I just didn't have a problem with it because if it worked, it worked. If it didn't, it didn't. Now, to me, it's like calling <laughs> the pot calling the kettle black, you know, because it was a lot of deals that people done did, you know, even like that, um, even like, because I've used that coupon, the Neutrogena coupon. It Nowhere on there does it say Neutrogena wipes. It said makeup, but you've seen a lot of people, you know, long-term couponers. That has the same problem with it. Long-term couponers that use that same $4 Neutrogena coupon. Now, I have a problem with that when you guys are bashing the people who use, you know, the did the Glade deal. It's been plenty of glitches, you know, and people have used them and went to do the deal. So, you know, to me, just, you know, d don't bash the people who got the deal. You know what I'm saying? It's and to me, it's like because you guys didn't get it fast enough or something like that. I don't know what it was, but I just feel like, you know, you shouldn't talk about other people if you really, you know, you've done it in the past or whatever, however it worked out. You know, you really shouldn't talk about other people or put them down because in all sense, any kind of glitch deal or anything that's giving you more than you're supposed to have is misuse and it's fraudulent. That's all I got to say. But anyway, let me dive right in to my um, Rite Aid haul. Now, this week, um, the baby, no, it's not the baby set of field. It's set of field, period. When you buy two at Rite Aid, you will receive, let me see if I can clear that up for you guys. You will receive 400 points. I don't know why. It's, there it is. You will receive 400 points. So, now, I was trying to get the cheapest thing because it does not exclu exclude um, baby products and it does not exclude the wipes. So, the baby products is priced at $6.99. So, it's buy one, get one 50% off. And um, so, one of them rang up at 6 no, I'm sorry, six forty nine, And then the other one rang up at three twenty four. And the wipes were set seven forty nine, And then... The other one rang up at, I think, $3.74, $3 okay? 
So I picked all four of those up. I used up two of the $7 off of two coupons that was on coupons.com. I don't know if they're still available. They were yesterday. So um, it took $7 off uh, both, you know, sets of two. So you will receive back $4 um, per set of two for um, the, 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 uh, I'm sorry, guys, <laughs> for the set of fuel. <laughs> so um, I got $8 back for that. That Then I had, um, I seen in this paper that they had these right here. Um, these are $2 off um, Rite Aid coupons. And we have 50 cent off coupons in our um, in our sales ad this week in the smart store. So if you use the 50 cent off, it'll be $2 and four. I mean, it'll be 49 cent instead of 99 cent. Okay. So... For but if you have gold, I believe it'll make it. Let me see, two dollars and ninety five cent instead of two dollars and ninety nine cent. And so, also, if you pick up one of these blade razors this week, the day logic, I'm, I'm sorry, blade razors, the day logic, it'll be five dollars. So, you just, just pick up you two of those, you can max the deal out at two of them. It'll you'll pay ten dollars out of pocket and you get back ten dollars and plenty points. Okay, you guys, um, my total came to I had a five off of 50 that I found on the ground <clears throat> and lately um because like it happens sometime lately they you know you'll see um a number attached to it if if it's a number attached to it then you, that means you can't use it if you find one and it's not it doesn't have a number attached to it you can go ahead and grab that and you can use it on your um next transaction so that's what i did i used the five off of 50 and my total for everything ended up being $16.66. But with tax, it came out to um, $19.29. I redeemed points and I got back $18. So that means that I only paid $1.29. Oh, yeah, I had to pick up two of the Snickers. They're on sale for a dollar because I had to get my total um, to $50. So they were on sale and I think I needed like $1.49 more. So I just grabbed two of those. And, um... <clears throat> That took me to my fifty dollar limit. So you know, I paid a dollar, like I said, a dollar twenty nine for all of these products, and I got back eighteen dollars and plenty points. Okay, you guys, I'm sorry for the rant at first, but you know, it kind of got under my skin a little bit. But you know, we're all couponers, you know, and you know, things happen, and I understand. So you know, you guys just have a blessed day.